everybody, my name's Hope and welcome back to my channel. I like musicals, they're a big part of my life and today I'm going to see another show. I'm going to see Gypsy at the Royal Exchange which I've not been to in at least three years. The last time I went was when I went to go and watch Into the Woods and now I'm going back to go and see Gypsy which will be really really fun. Also, grey walls. Sorry that was the last time you see the purple. If you miss it you can go and watch all my old videos and they have the purple and blue wallpaper well paint you know what I mean but anyway you're gonna come with me are yeah, you gonna come with me to go and watch another show Woo. I should also probably point out how much I know about Gypsy I have watched Gypsy the DVD with Imelda Staunton but I've not seen it live so it should be fun Okay, so this was the beginning of Act 1, this is what the stage looked like. As you can see, I have a very good seat, I was very privileged to have such a good seat. And yeah, so you can't really tell, but that's basically just furniture with like teddies on it. That's all that's really on the floor. And this huge like scaffolding is actually used during the show, like they spin it around and they hang like ropes off it and stuff. And people like actually climb up it and I thought that was like really, really cool. One thing I really liked about this production was the fact that it really used space very well and I appreciate that very much. And they had a train which just always improves the performance. Hey dudes, like always, this is like much longer after I've seen it. Saw it in December, it's now February, so what? But you know, I haven't forgotten it, I still remember everything, so I'm just gonna talk about it. So it was in the round, which I thought was really, really interesting, and it worked very, very well. One thing I thought worked extremely well was when they were going from the young June and Louise to the older versions. Basically, there was like this trampoline in the middle, and the older ones started running around the outside while the younger ones were jumping over it, and then they just kept doing it, and then somehow they switched them, so I didn't even notice. It was so seamless, I was like, oh my god, they got older, they've magically got older, and I thought that was really, really cool. So, Mama Rose was amazing. I watched Rose's turn and was like, oh my god, she's gonna have a heart attack because she's being so amazing. Um, one thing that I did notice was she's definitely an alto, and while Mama Rose is an alto part, there were some higher bits. I don't know if she was or if she wasn't, but to me, knowing so much about singing is kind of sounded like she was straining a little bit when she was on those higher notes but when she was in her lower register it was very very nice so i i did appreciate that i also watched the understudy for june like i do not baby june and i really liked her i didn't really see her as understudy material if that makes sense i didn't think she was any worse than the person who's actually playing her would have been if that makes sense i thought she played it quite well I did think her voice was a little bit nasally, but from all these recordings I've heard of like modern day, like even in the revival with Imelda Staunton, June had that tone about her, so it didn't really bother me too much, but yeah, I thought she was good too. Sorry guys, I'm like really sick right now. I've forgotten his name, Herbie, Herbie, the guy playing Herbie, he really impressed me. I could definitely see him, like his singing was absolutely lovely. I thought that he would fit really well in probably the show like Anything Goes, maybe as Billy or someone like that, because he just fits, fitted in really well and he had a very smooth voice if that makes sense. And I just thought he fit very, very well. But Louise, oh my god, Louise. I actually really, really liked her. The song Little Lamb is not one of my favourites. Like, it's passable. But she did sing it very, very lovely. And her evolution from, like, the beginning to the end of the show, I just thought was really, really good. She embraced the burlesque version of herself very, very well. And especially at the end, she... It, yeah, she did very, very well to have acted it the way she acted it, and she pulled it off very well. You could still see that kind of childish persona within her, even though she is now a very, very mature woman. And overall, the show, I just really, really enjoyed. Everybody stood up for Mama Rose when she finished Rose's turn. She, I think she also played everywhere. She didn't just play to one side, like, everywhere was played to. And I just think... 
the fact that it was in the round probably enhanced the experience of Gypsy rather than made it worse, which I think was really good. I watched the video of Gypsy and yeah, I enjoyed it, but I was like, oh my god, that was that was so good. But I think being part of it just kind of changed the dynamic completely, especially with Rose's turn. And I'm talking about this song a lot, but it was just, it was so, so good. And you just felt this cohesive feeling of, oh my God, in the room, because it was just purely silent, like no one was talking. Everyone was so mesmerized by her performance. And I just thought that that was really amazing. And the show itself, it was just really, really nice. And it fit very, very well. It did what it needed to do and I enjoyed it. Oh yeah. And my ticket was also like seven pounds. So I was sat on like the third or fourth row on the bottom of the Royal Exchange. So there's like three tiers. So um, yeah, look out for your student tickets, guys. Anyone under the age of like, I want to say it's 23, but it might be 26 actually. I'm not sure, but go and check it out because that's pretty cool. And that does it for this video. Hope you enjoyed it, even though I am now very sick and I actually saw this like two months ago. But you know, it's fine. Like the video if you liked it. I hope you did. Sorry my review is so short, but like, what can I do? <coughs> ML. But yeah, keep enjoying musicals as much as me. My posters are there. And they can't see the Ham Hamilton one that much, but there's no cycle one. Um, and I'll see you in the next one. Woo.